We do start tonight with possible federal prison time for a metro woman for allegedly buying guns for underage males. Federal investigators also accused the woman of having inappropriate sexual affairs with some of the juveniles. Our News 9 crime tracker Jennifer Pierce spoke to one of the gun dealers who knew something was wrong. The ATF investigation started in March after Oklahoma City police were tipped off about a woman allegedly buying handguns around the metro for underage males. Federal investigators laid out the details in this six-page affidavit. They say Tara Wood's husband notified Oklahoma City police after she told him she bought guns and allegedly brought the juveniles over to their home. The husband told investigators he found a receipt from H&H &H Shooting Sports. The general manager of the store says Woods came into the business three times over a three-week period. The third time, then it was like, okay, this is... This is really getting out of the norm. Rust says one of the visits, Woods brought someone with her. We pulled video, and on one of those videos uh, actually was one of the young men handing her uh, the cash to purchase the firearm. Investigators say Woods bought a total of 10 guns from multiple firearms dealers through straw purchases. The ATF director told News 9 in April his agency was working to crack down on the illegal practice. It means one person going and buying a firearm, not for them, but for somebody else. And a lot of times that somebody else is somebody who couldn't pass a background check themselves. Woods now faces three federal charges of making false statements during the purchase of a firearm. We're not ever going to put our license in jeopardy by turning a blind eye to the max punishment for straw purchasing is 10 years in prison or a fine of $250,000 or both. In Oklahoma City, Jennifer Pierce, Oklahoma's own News 9.